Welcome back everybody to Fresh Produce. I'm Pete from BTI. Today we actually have new product to show you from your favorite Maxis. So let's get right into it. First of all, here we go. The brand new Shorty, Shorty 2. They made some improvements on this new Shorty tire. So here's some of the detail. First of all, the center knob used to be a single block altogether. Now it's cut, so it's gonna flex a lot better and open up, uh, giving you a little better traction in the mud. And then all across, they've improved the siping. So there's deeper siping in the center knobs, deeper vertical sipings in the side knobs, all with the goal of improving mud traction. That's what this tire is really all about. This is the shorty tire. Really was originally made for as a mud tire, but don't forget it works super good uh, in blown out conditions too. So in the middle of the summer when the bike park is just dust and powder, this tire will still uh, dig in really well. So it's available in a couple of different casings, EXO, double down, and a downhill. I've got the, EX, the excuse me, I've got the uh, double down version right here, and this one's actually the max grip rubber too. So ultra sticky uh, without being a full on downhill tire. Uh, and this is gonna perform anytime that you just need to get the utmost in grip. So again, mud or super dusty. A couple other things they did with this tire compared to the old version. It's now in a 2.4 width as opposed to 2.5, kind of a minor difference, but it does mean the tire is a little bit more square and really offering the best grip uh, for those corner knobs especially. They also did a little small detail in between uh, all the side knobs and kind of every other group of center knob. Just these little raised, they're less than a millimeter tall, little raised bumps here. The idea is that's gonna break up some of the mud and allow it to shed slightly better. Again, a little different uh, construction on the side knobs. Just a whole bunch of details on this tire were updated so that, you know, perfecting it for increased grip and a little better all around use as well. So check that out, the Shorty tire, uh, and whole variety of casings and rubber compounds as well. All right, moving right along, another new one. This is the Maxxis Receptor. This is a gravel style tire, kind of a semi-slick or slick gravel tire. It does have a little bit of diamond pattern all through the center, but it's very low. So it's gonna roll really fast when you are on pavement. And then a unique uh, outer tread pattern with an actual side knob for cornering grip in those softer conditions. This tire is available in 650B by 47 or 700 by 40, okay? All right, I also wanna show you the brand new dark tan wall that Maxxis is rolling over to. Um, there still might be some of those lighter walls around, but going forward, we're gonna see all this darker style. So really cool, unique look. And I think it's gonna hold up over time really nicely as well. This tire that I've got specifically is the new, new to us at least, DTH 26 inch dirt jump tire. Um, you know, it's gonna be great rolling around town as well, but really meant to be used for pump track and dirt jump. Uh, it has a nice small corner knob on there, but overall smooth rolling pattern with still some decent braking traction and a great looking tire for your dirt jump bike. And just wrapping it up, we do have that new dark tan wall also in your classics like the DHR2. Um, so add a nice splash of color, just kind of something unique to your everyday trail ride as well. All right, if you're interested in the new tan wall color, or the new tread patterns like the Shorty 2 or the new Receptor, don't forget to ask at your local bike shop and tell them BTI sent you. Got a lot of Maxxis rolling in this year, so hopefully we'll keep you rolling. See you out on the trails. Thanks for watching.